Hi everyone, Ari here. I wanted to share a quick video with you all um, because some of you wanted to know exactly how I repaired my canvas. Um, I know I personally am a very visual person, so I totally understand how you would want to see it done. So the first thing that I would say is you have to set up your um, sewing kit. I'm not going to get into that. I think that's pretty self-explanatory. The instructions are in the kit and I want to keep this video short. So assuming you have everything ready, okay, just figure out. The first thing that you want to do is you want to pull enough thread out um, to accommodate the size of the repair. So if it's a five inch repair, pull five inches out. If it's a 20 inch like I had, then you pull out that much and it'll be easier um, if you do this ahead of time because you're going to be using this thread to secure the back of each stitch Okay, as as you'll you'll see in a second um, The second thing is figure out where you're going to start if this is the side of your canvas Let's say um, my repair started from here and it extended to the end I chose to start on the inside and work my way out as opposed to starting here and working to the middle um, because I feel like doing it this way just gave me a cleaner um, uh, look and it also was easier to just kind of tie knots at the end to secure the last stitch all right so decide where you're going to start and the first step is basically to make sure you grab onto all layers of your canvas okay and as you see the needles on the other side and you see this thread right here you want to basically lift this up Okay, and you want to pull the thread completely to the other side, completely out. All right, so now you have the thread on the other side. Now you're going to continue to the next position. And I like my stitches to be pretty close together because I want to make sure that I'm grabbing everything, that there are no holes, because um, that's the whole point of, of doing this so that we don't get any water through there. Now you have your second stitch. And again, you see the needle, you see the, the thread that's laying alongside the needle there. You want to pull that loop up again, up again and then you want to take your loose piece of thread and you want to feed it into that loop. Okay, and then grab it and you're basically going to make a knot. I am going to now pull my needle out and what that's going to do I can turn this so that y'all can see it I'm going to tighten it by pulling on both ends and that has created my first knot in the back and my first 